Hi there, YouTube community. How are you? Weaver here at Sea Smoke Pipes. Just wanted to hop on the old YouTube here and give you a quick little update on some things I got going on. I received a package in the mail yesterday from Mel Harris, the garbage man piper. And if you guys haven't been paying attention, Mel has been doing a lot of trading in the YTPC lately. I've traded with him for a few things. So we worked out a trade last week and he was really quick and got his end of the trade in the mail right away. I still have a box for him sitting on my table behind the camera right now. So I got to get that out Monday morning. I got a little sidetracked, so I'm a little behind. Smoking a little Peter Stockaby, proper English in the um, SNR small Canadian. So let's get on with this Yabo. Set the pipe down. So I opened this up already, but I haven't really, I just peeked inside a little bit. I didn't look too closely. Packaging. Okay. A little note from the Garbage Man Piper. Nice card here. Thanks for the trade, bro. Enjoy the backy. Garbage Man Piper. Sweet chicken, baby. All right, Mel. I'm sure, that I already have a pretty good idea what's in this box because, you know, it was a pre negotiated trade. But I know Mel always throws in some extra. I would call him the king of the Yabo. He's very, very active in working out trades and sending people packages and very enthusiastic so okay there's some tins in here I think I know what those are but it looks like we got some samples as well all right a little esoterica and soda bed thank you Mel I like that blend quite a bit so that's awesome Ooh, a nice little pouch of Dunhill nightcap another one of my favorites Ooh, Sammy G's Skiff Mixture. Never tried it. Never had it. Never have. Looking forward to that. Thank you. That'll be fun. I might smoke some of that later tonight. A little Seattle Pipe Club Mississippi River. Pressed cake. 519 VOLP. I don't know what v VOLP means, but thank you. Um, some Seattle Pipe Club Deception Pass. Never tried it. Cool. This is a great way to try new tobacco. It's just getting a little sample with like, you know, one to four bowls in it is great. Um, some more Seattle Pipe Club Hood Canal, Vulcan. Haven't tried that one yet either, so very cool. Okay. Okay, let's see what we got for tins. Oh, you really packed these ones well. Little Esoterica Margate. Can never have enough, enough of that. Mainly these are going to be Esoterica blends. Because that's what we worked out for the trade. I had couple rat trays that he wanted so some Dorchester Pembroke another one of my favorites And here's one that I haven't tried yet, Esoterica Dunbar. Never had it yet, so thank you. That'll be a good, good one to try. Seven premium Virginia tobaccos with little Louisiana Perique. Very good. Thank you, Mel. 
So that was the main part of the trade, but I see he also threw in another tin. Mel is always, he's always uh, <laughs> very generous. All right, Ashton's Artisan's bl Blend. I like this tobacco. I have one tin that I got in another trade a while back, and I really liked it. So I know I told Mel that I was looking for this blend as well, and he was kind enough to throw in an extra tin in the trade. Very cool. Thank you, Mel. I appreciate it. Okay. All right. Well, thanks a lot for watching, guys. That was the trade from Mel. Um, I think I might pop off and make another quick video on a couple of books that I got. Today or tomorrow I'll do that. So again, this is uh, Weaver at Sea Smoke Pipes wishing you happy smokes and I'll see you next time.